Hello everybody and a happy Tuesday. <clears throat> so, um, not really like workout related, but more food related. Um, Wednesdays are my like official weigh in days. So if you noticed in the last video, I said I was like about two pounds away from getting into the 100s, but my little like body shot photo said 204 points. I think it was like eight or six. Um, either way, um, that's because that was, the two pounds was from that morning and I never like keep, unless it's an official weigh-in day, I don't <clears throat> hold to the number any other day of the week because I'm a fluctuator and I'd rather do it once a week and not accidentally like it would have been today. Um, I'm at 203, so I lost a pound over the week, but it's not the two pounds that it was a couple days ago. But yeah, so I weighed in today because I have had a bowl of kimchi ramen sitting in my cupboards for a couple months now, and I've been meaning to eat it forever. The thing is, as we all know, instant ramen like has a lot of sodium in it. And for some reason, it's always on a Tuesday when I'm like, oh my God, I'm gonna have ramen for lunch. And then I realize, no, there's sodium everywhere in that thing. And I don't wanna risk that affecting my weigh-in on a Wednesday. So I'm like, okay, I'll have it on, like I'll eat it on Wednesday or have it Thursday instead. And then I forget I have it. And then Tuesday rolls around and then I'm like, oh my God, I've got my kimchi ramen. And then I realize, no, I'm weighing in tomorrow. It's just been this weird cycle every single week. And I remembered about it yesterday and I thought, hmm, you know what? I'll, I'll, I won't eat it. I'll, I'll weigh in on Tuesday and then I'll have it for lunch that day. So I finally got to eat my kimchi instant noodle because I don't buy ramen all that often, mainly because it, it's not very nutritious and it's also like super high in sodium and whatnot but that's like that's my guilty pleasure i love those instant kimchi noodles and um you put a slice of cheese you fry an egg it's a, it's a weird little crap meal and um but yeah i only have them like a few times a year and so yeah i bought this one probably beginning of january and i just haven't been able to fit it into my meal plan so that this sodium if I were to end up getting really bloated afterwards and get a lot of water retention <laughs> wouldn't affect my weight <laughs> so that's my that's my little update for the day because I'm pretty happy I got my my kimchi noodles <laughs> oh, it costs so much but it's my only option and they've got only like these flavors that's it my sock is my sock is falling off as I walk inside my boot. This isn't fun. My fate today. I'm shopping again. This time, d different time. My socks are falling down my shoes again. And that's my roommate. You've seen him, but not my husband. So there you go. <laughs> hey guys. So today is my first day off and I, um, my dad is coming over because I had some issues with my roof where I needed to, um, where it was leaking. And, uh, so I asked the guy that kind of looks after the neighborhood and does odd jobs to do stuff, but, uh, to go up there and look and, you know, but he hasn't come over. So I asked my dad and my dad is kind of one of those nitpicky people and he'll like, touch everything and looking at everything and you know make comments and stuff so I had to clean my room and because well the access to my attic is like right above me it's in my room and so I don't need my dad to see all my room stuff right so he's coming over and I'm just making sure everything's clean and out of the way and um <clears throat> After having the bronchitis, I have noticed after the last little while that um, if I went a little too fast at work or if I uh, exerted myself even a little bit, I 
got very winded. I had a hard time breathing. Um, I was coughing a lot. And ever since my doctor has pres gave me the, the cough syrup that I've, that I've been using, um, I haven't really been coughing. So um, to be coughing again is really, it, it sucks. So, so I cleaned my room and it took me about, God, about a half an hour, 45 minutes to get through all the stuff and move things around so that it's easy for, um, me and my dad to get up into. I'm so itchy. It's so dry here. I'm all dried out. It's so itchy. Um, so then me and my dad will have like easy access into the living and into the living room into the attic and I'll tell you what I wasn't going very fast I wasn't doing a lot of things and I am drenched in sweat I am tired I feel like I stink now <laughs> I kind of feel like I worked out to do this amount of work on a normal day shouldn't take I, I shouldn't be exerted this much or not exerted but I shouldn't be sweating this much and I shouldn't be you know as tired as I am but I think because of the bronchitis um, I'm a little more worn out and it's 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 a little disconcerting I guess so that's my day so far that's what I'm gonna do um, I kind of wanted to go for a walk today but it's cooled down. I don't actually know what the temperature is right now outside. I haven't looked. Um, but yesterday it was minus 20. Um, so, but it's been warm lately. So I've been wanting to go for a walk, but with the bronchitis. And then my kid said he was sick. He kept telling me that he had the flu. But he just wasn't feeling good. You know, he just was a little warm. A little listless. But... You know, he had the flu. So, yeah. So, that's my day. Um, I don't think, I am starting to get into the, okay, I need to work out. I need to do stuff. I need, because, you know, spring is coming and uh, that's usually when I get my, my kick in the butt to go do stuff. But I haven't done anything in a while actually but I've started getting the you know I want to go out for a walk I want to go do stuff I want to I, I drive by the gym every day and oh I want to go work out and so I'm probably not going to do too much <clears throat> too fast Leah is definitely way ahead of me on this she is more motivated than I am um so, I'll keep you guys updated on, on the sickness, and hopefully my roof things aren't too bad, and, um, and yeah, so if I decide to go out for a walk in the next couple of days, I'll, uh, hit the record button and bring you guys along for a little bit. So, okay, have a good Friday, have a good weekend. And uh, I'll see you later. Hello, happy Friday. I was going to be going to the gym today because um, I don't work till four, but that's out the window. It's already um, almost one o'clock. And uh, my husband and I are throwing out the old couch and we're just gonna get a futon to put in. So it's a lot of like clearing out where the couch used to be. Um, I just helped him carry it outside which is fun because it's such a mess please ignore that the door outside um is really wonky because that leads into the entryway which then cuts a sharp corner to go outside and um yeah now everything is outside and uh, muscles muscles working out pays off because it was just him and i we didn't have to wake up roommate to help us so yeah, I I need to eat. It's almost one, so I should break fast because I did more heavy lifting than I expected to before one. There's the couch. 
that I helped pull out. Now we're um, just empty out some so crap in the back of the van. So, you know, I helped lift it. I work. I lift weights. No big deal. I'm strong. Yeah. Now to carry a futon box. So we're talking about how I um, helped lift the couch, and I was like, "Yeah, see, working out has been helping." And he, and so he's like, "Yeah." I wanted to see if you could. <laughs> he was completely willing to wake up our roommate, but he just wanted to see if I could. Because why not? <laughs> the pan you need, not the pan you deserve. Alright, I'm home from work for the day. I worked at closing shift, and now I'm just like, got my blanket on. I'm catching up on YouTube videos, and like, Anthony... Um, his channel from fat to fat. He's one of the coolest guys. I uh, did a shout out video and he Threw a shout out for Marsha and I which I think is really cool. Thank you so much, Anthony um, and if you are subscribed to me and you've never or us that is and you've never heard of Anthony Please go check him out. He's really cool. He does a lot of videos and he is the funniest little dog little dog <laughs> Donatello is anything but a little dog and if you go watch the videos you'll see what I mean but he's such a cool cool dog too so yeah check out Anthony thanks so much for the shout out Anthony that was like the coolest thing ever um so yeah I'm gonna be working a split shift tomorrow as well so that's gonna be fun um so I don't know if this video is gonna be out of time because usually I try to edit either Friday night or early Saturday so I can get I like to have uh, at least like a Saturday and Wednesday video but this week with um, well the person who's been calling in sick is now no longer employed with us she quit and um, we're having to fill in her shifts because our other co-worker is out of town and like I mentioned on the other video um, and they are last I heard they were in Minneapolis waiting for their next flight to Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, and then they will drive home tomorrow. And uh, I'm looking forward to having them back because I really miss them. And they're like really good friends of ours. But um, yeah, so I'm picking up a lot of extra shifts. Marsha is going to be babysitting Kate tomorrow evening, which is great so that uh, my other coworker doesn't have to be alone on a Saturday evening because if it's anything like it was tonight, it's going to be bonkers. Uh, so yeah, I don't know when this video, what time this video is going to come up because I know Marsha told me she has a clip and she has to get that to me and uh, and I have to be able to sit down and edit everything and I'm not going to be able to do that with a two hour break between my, my shifts. So yeah, and it might be another late night tomorrow like it was with my last Saturday video that was actually uploaded on a Sunday so this is where I'm gonna leave with you guys as far as this is concerned right now you've already watched Marsha's clip and here I am talking about editing and whether what what time I'm gonna get it and when this video is gonna be up but either way I really appreciate everybody that's subscribed Anybody that's come over from Anthony's channel, welcome. Thank you very much for stopping by and helping to support us. Um, the YouTube fitness community, community has been one of the most supportive places so far. And I'm meeting some of the coolest people. And I really appreciate everybody that stops and comments. And I know Marsha does too. So thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Leave a comment below. And I hope everybody's having a good week and weekend. Bye.